Poland, September 1939. The German foe begins its ruthless march of conquest and sets the stage for World War II. The 1st of September 1939, Hitler invaded Poland, beginning the Second World War. The Silesian house in Poznan, in Wernieska Street, was occupied and turned into a barracks for German soldiers. The young people continued gathering in the woods outside the city as well as in the city gardens. A number of secret societies came into being. In September 1940, Francis Kesey and four companions from the oratory were arrested and accused of belonging to an illegal organization. They were taken to the fearful Fourth Seven near Poznan. They were then moved first to the New Kong prison and then to Zwickau, where they were questioned and tortured and then condemned to hard labor. Two notes show that we are dealing with giants of the spirit. God alone knows that we are suffering. Prayer was our own support in the darkest nights and days. God has given us this cross and He is giving us the strength to carry it. They prayed constantly. Rosary, Navina to Don Bosco and Mary Help of Christians, morning and evening prayer. When it was possible, they celebrated liturgical feasts happily in their cell. Their faith never wavered. They remained credible witnesses until the end. They were condemned to death for treason on August 1, 1942. The verdict was followed by a long silence until one of the five exclaimed, Thy will be done! They were condemned simply for belonging to Catholic organizations which it was suspected might give rise to resistance movements. Before they die, they were able to write to their parents. Reading these lines, one is astounded as before the truly great. As an example, these are the words written by Francis. My dearest parents, brothers and sisters, the time has come to say goodbye to you on August 24, the day of Mary Help of Christians. May the good Lord take me to himself. Don't have regrets that I am leaving this world so young. I am now in the state of grace. I am going to heaven. There I shall pray to God. Pray sometimes for me. I am going now. They were taken into the prison yard in Dresden and beheaded.